to watch this. I'm Nikki Boyer. Today's guest has set hearts of flutter on daytime hits such as General Hospital and Port Charles. But currently, Eddie Mato stars in the new CBS series, Kane. Why don't we take a look? So listen, I had some plans done for a VIP rooftop addition to the club. Some place exclusive, attract celebrities, bump the place's profile up a notch. Just sell the model. Kicks. So I need a loan from the business. 500000 gets the job done. I'll make that back in bottle service in six months, man. Okay, a year, whatever. The point is that this is going to put my place on the map. What a handsome devil, huh? I know. <laughs> Eddie Matos is here. Show some love. Love. Thank you. See? Thank you. We love you. Thanks for being here today. Uh, it's my pleasure. So my I'm pleasure. loving the show. Kane, give everybody out there who hasn't seen it a little idea of what the show is about and a little bit about Henry, your character. Kane's a, a, a little uh, drama. Um, <laughs> a, little a little drama, <laughs> you know. And uh, like every drama, it's got its uh, twists and turns. And um, it's basically about the Duque family, who is a very powerful Cuban-American family, came to this country with nothing and has built this rum empire. And uh, it, um, it has to do with... Um, inner conflicts um, within the family. And we also have a rival family of Samuels who wants to take our business away from us. So uh, we got our little struggles with them too. But it's hot, it's sexy, it takes place in South Beach, in South it Florida. Um, my character, Henry, is a club owner. He uh, owns part of the family business, but his main uh, goal is to take this club and make it into the biggest club uh, in South Beach and eventually in the world. So uh, what's great about my character is that um, I get to be with a lot of beautiful women. Well, that's a I bring <laughs> I bring great music to the show, and uh, along with that, um, if uh, if you stay tuned for next week, we're going to have Nicole from the Pussycat Dolls going to be on. That's what we down heard. the road. We got Alicia Keys coming down, and uh, our first first episode we had Daddy Yankee. Yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. This is, yes. so You kind of have Daddy the Yankee. best job on the show. You get to own a club, hang out with hot chicks, and I love have it. Musical let me guest stars. Let me tell you, I I love my character. I love that aspect of my character and that aspect of the show. But you know what? We have a pretty good cast. Oh, hello. And the cast is I don't, amazing. And, and, and although I love playing the character of Henry and doing the stuff in the nightclub, I don't like being too far away from Jimmy Smith's, Hector not. Elizondo, Nestor Carbonell, Rita Moreno. Right. Yeah. Well, what I love about your character mm. is that you are in the family business, but you sort of kind of stay on the outskirts. You're not so much involved in... Um, sort of the inner politics that are going on, because any family business is going to obviously have a lot of arguing and bickering. Right, right. So do you think, Henry, your character is going to sort of stay focused on the club? <laughs> are you going to get a little more involved in what's really going mm. on with the family? Well, <laughs> you know, on, um, our show has been compared to a lot of different, uh, like uh, other shows, uh, like da Dynasty Dallas, and also films, uh, classic films like The Godfather. Right. And the one thing that I like about uh, my character, it's that it's got that, I think it's going to have that thing, like uh, that Godfather thing, where he is outside, he is doing his own thing outside of the family, but little by little he's going to start getting pulled into okay. the family. And because as uh, us Latinos tend to be very tight with our families and very protective of our families, then Henry is going to gravitate towards the family and towards the family business eventually. Okay. That's what I think. I'm That's not giving any secrets away. Okay. All right. But your actor's <laughs> intuition is telling My you that. My intuition. Hold on. It's yes. telling you that. Okay. Yes. Um, another thing is, you know, you have Daddy Yankee and Pussycat yeah. Dolls, and then um, if you had to pick sort of your favorite, your sort of dream celeb to come and be in your club, who would it be? Wow. I mean, um, you get one shot to pick. One shot? Yeah, I mean, that's it. <laughs> um, you know, oof, uh, if it was up to me, yeah? the, the, these, these, the musical act I would pick wouldn't be on the show because it doesn't fit the club. Oh, it doesn't. But who, who you is know, like, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm huge in 80s rock, Van Halen, you know, Could you imagine bon Van Halen? Van Halen yeah, at Club like DK, it ain't going to happen. <laughs> but if it was for the ladies and if we wanted, if it was for the ratings and everybody in the world we tuned in, I think Justin Timberlake's probably one of the hottest oh, stars yeah. out there right now that on his tour. Good. I watched actually um, on another channel. I forget what it was. But I, I liked it. I enjoyed it. And I think he'd be huge on our show. Well, hey, uh, so if you're out there, yeah, JT. JT. <laughs> 
come through Club Duque. Well, everybody's crazy about the show. People are comparing it to The Sopranos, the mm -hmm. mob family, which is not a bad comparison. Hey, not bad at and, all. And um, you did a ton of daytime TV. You've sort of... Not that much. But... Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> and everybody's going to love you in, in prime you time. Think? And I'm a big fan, i got to tell you. Well, and I'm well, really glad you. that you came to hang thank out Thank you with us so today. much. It's a pleasure it being so here. It was so nice watch to meet Kane. you. Yeah, watch it. Be sure to catch Kane <laughs> on Tuesdays at 10, 9 central on CBS. Coming up, the claws come out on MTV's pageant place. And next, skinny girl plus buzz cut equals top model. So stay tuned.